When you photograph or painting, you can almost picture the subtle movements that the artist or photographer is suggesting. Wouldn't it be interesting if we could somehow put some of this movement back into the picture? In this paper, we show how using a combination of interactive editing and stochastic motion models, we can bring such pictures to life. We use an interactive object selection tool to specify a trimap. We then apply Bayesian matting to extract the layer. After extracting each layer, we use an inpainting algorithm to fill the resulting hole in the background. We repeat this process from the closest to the furthest layer. Our system is to specify and edit the individual motions. For example, we specify gram plane for this layer and assign rippling water. We specify and edit the motion parameters to obtain the desired effect. For example, we can change the wind speed, the wind direction, or the roughness of the water surface. Size time varying stochastic displacement fields and put all the layers back together. We want the user interacting with our system. Give this input image, we extract the water and the trees. Here rendered video for this example. Our realistic results for wind speeds encountered on a relatively calm day. But we can scale up the wind speed for a more fanciful result. And then scale it back down. We build more compelling than those possible with previous tools, such as the Java Lake applet. Let's take a look at how we can create another animated image with this new example. And they also map the clouds and add a translational motion. Same techniques to animate paintings. Monet's water lilies. We animate the water and some lily pads. Poplars along the river Ept. We sway the trees and ripple the water a little. Boat studio, we animate the water and let the boat sway with the water. Here, painting, we segment out three boats the water, the shore and the bridge, the eleven trees, and the clouds and sky. We animate each layer and combine them together. In our, we have animated Van Gogh sunflowers. There are a total of 27 animated layers in this sequence. And, and user control, we are able to use our animated pictures in surprising places, such as a screensaver or desktop wallpaper. We enjoyed watching our animated pictures.